Rescue breathing is a technique to assist a patient who is not breathing. We will demonstrate rescue breathing using an embu bag. Assemble the embu bag and check for self-feeling. Ensure that the face mask is well inflated. Inject more air if needed. A deflated mask may cause pain and air leakage. Connect the embu bag to the oxygen source if needed. Perform suction for tracheostomy tube. If the patient is using a cuff tube, inflate the cuff with 6 to 8 ml of air. Attach the embu bag to the tracheostomy tube. You may use the track adapter for easy connection. If the patient has no tracheostomy tube or the tube is blocked, use the face mask with the CE method. Gently cover the patient's nose and mouth with the face mask. Create a firm seal with one hand. Use your thumb and index finger to form a C on top of the mask. Spread the other three fingers along the patient's jawbone in an E shape. Hold tightly but not to press on the soft tissue below the jawbone. Tilt the head slightly backwards and lift the chin up so that air can enter easily. Deliver rescue breaths by squeezing the embu bag with one hand about one third to half of the balloon. Press 2 a thousand, 3 a thousand, 4 a thousand, 5 a thousand. Press 2 a thousand, 3 a thousand, 4 a thousand, 5 a thousand. This will provide about 12 breaths per minute. If you find it difficult to follow this method of counting, you may use another method. Breathe in, breathe out, one, two, three. Breathe in, breathe out, one, two, three. Breathe in, breathe out, one, two, three. This will provide about 16 breaths per minute. Do not ventilate too fast as the patient will not have enough time to breathe out completely. If the patient can breathe, Follow the patient's breathing pattern to squeeze the embu bag. Look out for the eye on the embu bag and the patient's chest rise. Adjust the mask and the position of the patient's head if the chest is not rising. Monitor the patient for the colour of the face and fingernails, SpO2 levels and heart rate. Contact the ambulance if the patient becomes unstable or unconscious. Start performing CPR if the heart stops beating. Thank you for watching. For more information, contact HVRSS or speak to your doctor today.